Okay, let's start out with the differences between the two. This is a series circuit. The defining characteristic is that there is only one path for the electricity to flow through. The figures you see along the sides of the current are called resistors. These are placed to resist the flow of electricity around the circuit, or in any other sense, things that resist the flow of electricity. Think of a lamp, television, or any other thing. So if one chain is broken, all the resistors fail. Uh, an example of this would be Christmas lights. Next, we have the parallel circuit. The premise of this circuit is to have chains offshooting the main electrical flow, so that even if one resistor fails along the flow, all the other resistors can continue working. Finally, we will discuss the uses of both parallel and series circuits. The parallel circuit is used for the most part in modern appliances. The rooms in your house probably run on a parallel circuit. If it didn't, when you turned off a light, everything in the room would shut down, because the circuit relies on the resistors to keep the electrical flow complete. However, older houses were built using the series circuit.